welcome back to another video it's your boy busy back with some more marvel's avengers content now today we're going to talk about everything you need to know about pre-order bonuses and each edition to help make the buying process a lot smoother for you guys so first let's start out with the pre-order bonuses if you pre-order marvel's avengers on ps4 xbox one or steam you will receive the following bonuses so to start off you will receive marvel legacy outfits essentially these are outfits that are inspired by moments from the comics that define each avenger as they embrace their powers to become the icons they are today so basically each character is getting their first original outfit from the comics so starting with thor his outfit is called asgard's might he's rocking the winged helmet chest installations and the red cape black widow's outfit is called classic stealth the first time black widow ever appeared in the comics she had on this suit captain america's suit is called frontline it was the first time he was enlisted into the military during world war ii hulk's outfit is called breakthrough when the hulk first emerged his massive body tore through bruce banner's clothing so he still has that ripped white t-shirt miss marvel's outfit is called greater good before she went on her first mission she made a makeshift outfit and last but not least iron man's suit is called iron will it was the first time he was able to deceive his captors by building this armor to escape so this is his original iron man costume now you will also get an exclusive nameplate it says embrace your powers avengers in addition you will get access to the open beta we do not have any details on a beta yet we will get that this month during the next war table stream in addition you will get 72 hours of early access to play the game so you will be able to play three days early now this is only with the deluxe and the earth's mightiest hero edition you will not be able to play early if you pre-order the base game now crystal dynamics does have a partnership with playstation 4 so people who pre-order on playstation will have a few extra bonuses so if you pre-order on playstation 4 you will get a thousand in-game credits for cosmetics and customization you will also get an exclusive miss marvel nameplate an exclusive psn theme now i'm not gonna lie to y'all the psn theme is super basic it's not even worth putting up as your psn theme all it is is the marvel's avengers basic logo with a hexagon pattern they definitely definitely could have gave us some heat but i don't know why they decided to give us this trash but nonetheless you will also get a miss marvel talk to the hand emote and playstation users will get early access to the beta before any other platform my guess is that they'll get access to the beta a week before everybody else that's just my guess about it but we'll learn more this month at the war table stream now when it comes to your editions there are only three editions there is the base game there's the deluxe edition both physical and digital and there's also the earth's mightiest hero edition which is physical only now if you pre-order the base game this should be self-explanatory you're not getting any additional content you're just getting the base game now for getting the deluxe edition you're gonna get an obsidian outfit pack and six obsidian hero nameplates now i'm not gonna hold y'all these outfits are clean like my man thor has the black cape fire black widow is looking like a snack captain america looking like he ready to rob a bank that gold gray and black iron man suit is just absolutely clean so i'm definitely looking forward to rocking these outfits now if you do get the earth's mightiest edition first of all it's starting out at a whopping 200 dollars now what it comes with is a 12 inch statue of captain america a hulk bobblehead a majoner keychain black widows belt buckle and iron man's prototype armor blueprint also kamala khan's honorary avenger pin and a commemorative avengers group photo now do i think this is worth 200 dollars? hell no but to each his own now i want to point this thing out for you guys because a lot of people don't catch this but there is no dlc in any of the editions which is honestly the best thing they could have done this is absolutely 
absolutely amazing. This means you can purchase the base game and get all DLC content. All DLC content will be free no matter what edition you get. This is the best part about this game. Like all DLC is free. You don't have to worry about characters, missions, nothing. Everybody gets that for free. So in my honest opinion, I would go for the base game unless you really care about those cosmetics one and two the main point is if you want to play three days early the main part about pre-ordering and buying this early is if you want to play the beta and if you want to play three days early that is honestly the only reason why you would be buying the deluxe edition and keep in mind the deluxe edition is $80 so you're basically paying to play early and they're just throwing in some cosmetics as well so basically if you can wait to play the game you can hold out get the base game you'll get all DLC all additional content for free but if you can't wait like me I'm a content creator I need to get the game as soon as possible so it's no brainer for me to get the deluxe but for other people it's going to be different but that is it for today's videos if you have any additional comments concerns and questions let me know down below also just let me know which edition you're gonna get i'm going with the deluxe so i can play early because i honestly can't wait to get my hands on this game but that is it for your boy don't forget to share like and subscribe if you're new and i'll catch y'all in the next one i'm out this mother